Tower Hamlets has the shortest life expectancy of all London boroughs, with men living on average five years less than men in Kensington and Chelsea. We have the 12th highest prevalence of diagnosed diabetes, major challenges with obesity among children, high levels of smoking, HIV, SDIs, and drug addiction. And even though many of my constituents abstain from alcohol, Tower Hamlets has, unfortunately, the seventh highest number of people with alcohol dependency. In 2017, Sir Michael Marmot warned that the historic rise in life expectancy, the result of centuries of improvements, have ground to a halt. It is almost beyond belief that centuries of progress should end on our watch. And the IFS has warned about some of these challenges, including around suicide and drug overdose and alcohol-related liver diseases, which are affecting middle-aged men across England. So given the scale of the challenge and the dangers, going, dangers of going backwards, what are the ministers doing about it? You would think our ministers would be investing in the kinds of programs that would help tackle the public health emergency. But instead, we're seeing significant funding cuts. As many honourable members have said, in my borough, we're losing, we've lost three million pounds since 2015-16 in one of the areas with the highest deprivation and child poverty in the country. So, Mr. Speaker, what we need is investment from the government to tackle the public health challenge, because otherwise all the investment the government is making in the National Health Service will be undermined, as many have pointed out, and the government will be missing a trick. This is a debate where we should be unified in tackling the public health challenge in all our constituencies. And ministers talk about working across party. So my appeal to ministers today is put that to the test put the investment in, support local agencies, local authorities and our health professionals and let's deal with this, this appalling challenge that it's desperately needed by working together. Yeah. Yeah.